What's up? And I mean that, man. Damn, we are back on GTA 5 Online. The excitement is real. Your boy is happier than anything else. We got a lot to talk about. We got the giveaway, man. You guys got to get in on that because I'm going to start announcing the winner this weekend, okay? Some of the winners will be announced. We have 10 winners to pick. I got no time at Christmas time to sit and announce winners. Make sure you're in on this giveaway. We got a solo unlimited money glitch. We got a brand new DLC. The excitement's real. Let's strap down. Don't strap it on. Strap down and let's do this, baby. Now. I might look like the Michelin man, but you know what? It's freaking cold outside. It's freaking cold. And I love it because I feel like I live in a completely different world than what we have during the spring and the summer. Truly, if you guys live in Toronto, Ontario, you do experience four different seasons and all of them look completely different from one another. All right, if I had to pick something, I think the fall would be my favorite. I'm the most comfortable in that and I love the setting of it. But my goodness, outside, I mean, you could probably see it from the windows in the car. It's freaking white all over, man. We got snow, it's drizzling. It's, it's like a whole different feel. Now, if you're wondering what the hell is that box up there, we'll leave that for another video, okay? If you have any comments or any concern, you can put them, but don't worry about that box. That's some business for a whole different story. For today, man, we got a lot of stuff to talk about. Brand new DLC right here on GTA 5. Unbelievable, unbelievable. And I'll get into it, why? How many people give up on this game? How many people told Rockstar, oh, and by the way, we, we have a solo unlimited money glitch that's going to happen very soon here, but I'm doing that. You know what? I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit and we'll get into the solo unlimited money glitch, but I want to hook up with you guys a little bit, man. This video is all about GTA 5 and the craziness that's happening right now, man. We did not see this coming. This company truly has us by the balls. They do, okay? I'm one of the happiest people to say I'm back on GTA 5. I must have spent hours upon hours playing Red Dead Redemption, which I truly like. But man, the game just doesn't compare to GTA 5. I mean, you sit in a car in GTA 5, you get from point A to point B, you're enjoying your time. Red Dead Redemption, I'm like clicking the button. I was telling my friend yesterday, click the X button on the PlayStation, click, 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 then put the damn horse on cruise control. By the time he gets to the destination, um, maybe the mission has disappeared or something has happened, maybe you lost interest by the time you get there. Next thing you know, it's bedtime for me, right? Because I don't get that time to sit and spend on a game six hours, eight hours, got two hours to play. Kids, work, wife, um, projects that I gotta work on on the side. Then you guys, I gotta hook you up with the best methods when it comes to money, this and that. I'm like, the two hours, Okay, go to the right side of the map, go to the left side of the map, now spend a lot of money teleporting, or if you just want to sit there and wait for the game to load you through. And it gets a little bit tedious, man. I think Rockstar has a lot of work to do when it comes to Red Dead Redemption. You know what? Teleporting from one end, to the end of the map to the next has to be free in a game like that, that you're depending on a horse. Can you imagine the next game you'll be depending, let's say, not on a horse, depend on your legs. And the more you click X, the more you're going to jog faster. And now they're going to tell you pay money to teleport because you're walking through a huge map. It's like, you guys, you should have thought about this a little bit more. No cars, us sitting there tapping the X button just doesn't make sense. You know what? Let's get back to this biznizzle right here. And this game is alive and well, and I'm so happy to see that. 2020 GTA 6, so be it. We'll see you then. For now, we're enjoying GTA 5, and they just gave us some amazing new content. Now, earlier today, which is now, I just saw an amazing glitch on somebody's channel. Now, if that glitch is active and it's true, I'm going to give you guys full detail who the person who found it is or whose channel I saw it on, and I'll hook you guys up with it. For now, we're going to test it, okay? I have the money. I know you guys don't want to risk it, but let's give this a try, man. The DLC just got released today. Will this work or not? Welcome to fake or real on your sheriff. You guys know how we do it. Let's do this, baby. Hit me up with a couple of thumbs up. Make sure you comment below and let's do this, baby.
All right, boys, I got you hooked up right here on GTA 5 Online. We are going to go into an invite-only session. Now, this glitch right here is posted countless times on YouTube, and it's supposed to be active on the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. Of course, the users on PlayStation 4 benefit a little bit more than the people on Xbox One. With that, I figured, you know what, let's test the glitch on the Xbox One, see if it's active or not. And at the same time, we'll give the steps for the people that are playing on the PlayStation 4. So it's a glitch test, and at the same time, these are the steps that you are going to follow in order to do the glitch on the PlayStation 4. All right? Now, there is a big risk, whether you're playing on this system or that system, that if your timing is not correct, you are going to go ahead and lose the money that you are betting. Because I have a lot of money on this game, I don't mind spending the time testing it. When it was all said and done, people are saying this will take you around 2 minutes in order to do this glitch. It took me over 22 minutes in order to get it. Because when you sit through the, um, the loading screens and the clouds, you know how GTA is. And we are doing a glitch at the same time, so it makes a huge difference. Anybody that comes here on the channel and says we're not doing something good, they can go ahead and eat it, man. Because I put in the time... I spend my hard-earned money in that game in order to warn you guys about what's what. So if you don't like it, you shouldn't be here to begin with. Now, I've launched into an invite-only session, and that's what you're supposed to do in the beginning. From there, you're going to go toward your club or a garage that have one of your social club allergies. That's the one that you're going to replace. That's the promise of this glitch. From here, they tell you you can buy anything that you want in GTA 5 Online, including the brand new vehicles that came with this DLC. In my case, I want the one that looks like the Nissan 350Z. I think that's the model. I positioned the Social Club Allergy in the entrance of the garage for the nightclub. Now, notice how much money I have with me. And at this point, you got to be very comfortable with moving around on the menus, whether it's the Xbox or the PlayStation 4 because what you have to do is go toward your network settings and you're gonna disconnect and connect instantly once you do that you're gonna try to join a friend so we'll take it one step at a time we're gonna purchase the vehicle but because the Xbox One's menus are a little bit tricky you're gonna join a friend and then there is a 10 second period that's gonna count down as you're counting it down you are going to get ready to purchase this vehicle. Now, I basically thread the needle on that one because I purchased the vehicle. I confirmed the second I did so, the invitation was ready to join my friend. Once you're joining your friend, this is when you're going to run toward your network settings and you're going to disconnect the connection to the internet. From there, connect it right away. And the people tell you that you're going to sit here for around two minutes. I kid you not. I sat here for 10 minutes, okay? And on the Xbox One, man, you're sitting here and then you're going to have to pop your interaction menu to try and join somebody else. On the PlayStation 4, you're going to get a warning that's going to tell you you've been timed out and that's when you're going to join someone else. On the Xbox One, you could sit there on that screen. It's not going to change until you join somebody. From there, on the Xbox One, things take a turn for the worse, man. This is when it gets really messed up for us. For the PlayStation 4, you're going to join somebody, and from there, it's going to give you that timing out thing, but then it's going to load you into the person's lobby, and you'll find the car in your nightclub spawned there for you. For us on the Xbox, however, be very careful, because what happened with me is I bounced into a different room, and I went into my nightclub, and lo and behold... The vehicle was here, and I was very excited and as, as I was loading in. I'm like, yes, I nailed it, but I forgot how much money I had in the beginning of the video. But this glitch did not work on the Xbox One. It's definitely not active. It's only working on the PlayStation 4, so we're going to have to sit this one out. For the guys on Xbox One, if you're desperate for a glitch, the best thing I could tell you right now is make your money in the double payouts, double RP. You're going to make a ton of money and you'll be ready for the next glitch. This is the only glitch that's active right now. The one with disconnecting the internet. You have to accept it. The Xbox One does not let you disconnect your internet and go back toward a friend and load your session again. 
it boots you out and it messes up the entire process. It's one of those things that's more active on the PlayStation than the Xbox One. Keep it tuned right here. Make sure you have your notifications turned on. Once we have a killer solo limited or unlimited, that is, money glitch, you'll find it right here on the share. I'll see you guys on the next segment. Peace, baby.